Hi everyone, Deborah Sable here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to insert automatic page numbers and how to customize the way they look. Okay, on my page I have just some dummy text, and as you can see down here in the uh, lower left corner, I have four pages all together. So I'm going to scroll the page, the document up so I can look at the bottom of the first page and the top of the second page. And in order to put in automatic page numbering, you can go to the insert menu and over here in the header and footer group you have the page number button so when I click that I've got all these choices tons of them if I want to look at the page numbers that are at the top of the page I can just scroll over here go over here and scroll down to all the different styles they have for that and you can do that for all of these different positions I like to go to the bottom of the page for my page numbering, but before I do that, let me just mention this. You may have uh, noticed this down here at the bottom. It says Format Page Numbers, which changes how the page numbers look, but it's not the same thing that I'm talking about. If you click here, Format Page Numbers, you get this little dialog box, and here's where you can decide where the numbering begins. It doesn't have to begin with one. It can begin at any number you want it to. Um, and you can choose the format of the numbering. It can be numbers, letters, Roman numerals, you know, whatever you prefer. But that's not what I'm talking about. I'm going to cancel that. I'm going to click page number and choose bottom of the page. And I'm going to scroll down to find a style that has color in it. So as I, here's one, here's a good one. This circle is a big blue circle and it's filled in and the number's in the center of it. So I'm going to choose that one. And as you can see, it has placed the automatic page numbers at the bottom of each of the pages. Now, if I don't like that color blue, I like, let's say I like the style, but I don't like the color. I want to change that color. You can do that by clicking inside the circle so that you see this little box, this little selection box come up, and you see these little uh, sizing handles around it. And when, when you have selected that, that's when you can change the way it looks. What you want to do is place your mouse inside the circle and double click. When you double click, you get this shortcut menu and if you don't get if you don't see this shortcut menu that's okay because you will see the menu choice the same menu choices up here on the ribbon and so if i want to just change the color blue if i want to do that what i would do is go here to the shape format contextual tab and when you click on that to bring this ribbon forward you can see here in the shape styles group there is a choice for the shape fill so if I click that I get all these choices of colors and as I hover my mouse over these different colors it shows me a preview of what that particular shape fill would look like so I can pick any of the ones here or I can go to the gradient and choose gradients or I can choose a texture, something really bizarre. Or let me go back to more fill colors. Um, textures are not really a good idea, actually, for page numbering uh, colors because it's hard to read the page numbers then. But you can use a picture that you've uploaded if you would uh, want a customized photo or picture that you found on the internet or something that you created yourself. Or you can just go here to more fill colors and you can click and drag by the title bar to move it over and you can choose any of the colors here or go to the custom tab here and just pick something out something that you like and when you find what you like you can make a little adjustments here to the red green blue uh, numeric values or you can just click OK when you're ready click OK and it'll pick up that color and to see it properly you would click anywhere outside of the circle and so that's how you can modify and customize any automatic page number 
that has any kind of color or uh, customizable shape. 